Good morning. Good morning, Becky. Welcome in. You are indeed the first. <laughs> oh. Yeah, Weeksy 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 takes a bit of a break from streaming, so uh I, I, I jump in on a Saturday spot. Um which is why I'm here. Alright. Let's turn this on. Let's hope everything works. I just had to fight with OBS because my scenes just randomly disappeared. That's why you don't do updates before you stream. Very bad idea. <laughs> just in general. Alright. Yep. No game demo. I don't need that. Yes, so, uh, we're playing Super Metroid. But it's not Super Metroid. It's Super Metroid Redux. It's a modified version, uh, which makes the game a lot more fun. Hopefully. I've only played through it once. It's the only Metroid game I haven't played through on stream yet. So, uh, here we are. Ignore my test file. <laughs> How are we doing? Um, I'm doing well. Uh, still recovering a bit from a cold. As you might be able to hear, but um, other than that, um, I'm good. No more work for the year. I couldn't be happier. <laughs> I hope you've been doing well, Becky. I haven't spoke to you in quite a while. Incredible streamer right there. Oh, my days. <laughs> I was like, okay, I'm going to start 10 minutes early. Just in case anything I need to fix, I can fix it. And then I just sit here for half an hour being like, where is my game scene? <laughs> Can't find it. Uh, English text. Normal mode. Auto run on. I didn't even know this was an option. I'll take it. Nah. I mean, it's been my fourth call uh, since autumn started, but it's 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 fine. <laughs> it's gonna be alright. DJ! Look at me being the most bestest guy ever. And now the sound alerts work again. I don't know. Sometimes they do, sometimes they do. How are you doing, T Um I hope I hope both of you have a had a had a good uh, Christmas preseason, by the way. You sound a bit sick. I was sick. That's why I wasn't streaming last week. <laughs> the last Metroid is in captivity. The galaxy is at peace. This game has voice acting and I forget it every single time. Well, only a bit. Oh boy, here we go. I first battled the Metroids on planet Zebus. It was there that I foiled the plans of the space pirate leader, Mother Brain, to use the creatures to attack galactic civilization. The English is also a tad bit broken in this game, so, uh. That's <laughs> how so it works when Automat Metis comes in. I next found the Metroids on their home world, SR388. I completely eradicated them, except for a larva. Which, after hatching, followed me like a confused child. It's the baby. I was wondering about last time. Yeah, I wanted to, and I was like, no, I'm, I'm, I'm sick. I don't want to. It wasn't school that made me sick this time, though. It was my dad. <laughs> I personally delivered it to the Galactic Research Station. The scientists could study its energy producing qualities. I wonder about it every week. <laughs> yeah, streaming on a regular schedule is hard, turns out. The scientists' findings were astonishing. They discovered that the powers of the Metroid might be harnessed for the good of civilization. I had three sick days from Monday. Well, it was also, I also had three sick days from Monday to Wednesday. So, you know. <laughs> Perfectly in sync. Satisfied that all was well, I left the station to seek a new bounty to hunt, but I had, had hardly gone beyond the asteroid belt. A distress call. The station was under attack. So one nice thing this uh, mod adds is that you are actually able to skip this intro. Which I didn't, but you could. Can't be honest, streaming. It's funny. 
Well, I mean, Wixie's on a streaming break. I kind of had a semi-streaming break for the last two weeks. So, you know, maybe, maybe once next year rolls around, there will be more streams again. <laughs> Wait, everyone. Okay, let me get to check the controls. So, what does this mod actually do, aside from a few simple quality of life things, is it kind of makes the physics be more like the GBA games. And I love the GBA games. Um, because normally Super Metroid controls kind of like... How do I put it? It very much feels like you're in space. Um, this makes the gravity and everything a bit more snappy. Makes it a lot more fun to play. A lot easier to play as well, which is good because I suck at Super Metroid. I've only played through the game once in my life. I kind of started a second playthrough and then I got stuck. <laughs> Alright. Gonna do the quick strat method here. Because you can't actually beat Ridley here. So I just want to trigger the cutscene as quickly as possible. Which once you drop down to emergency health... Self-destruct sequence activated. Hey. Go, 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 go! My time on Rich has drastically reduced over the year. <laughs> I mean... Things always change, right? Should I summon Steamy? I think Steamy is also sick. Um... Or at least yesterday she said that she uh, caught a cold or something. But you can try it. With a ripple until after breakfast. I don't think I... I... No, I never had like a Red Bull before breakfast. Now, to be fair, I've cut down on energy drinks like massively. I don't think I had one in last three or four months even um, kind of realized they uh, gave me a, give me a headache so I was like nope not doing it anymore <laughs> we're sticking we're sticking to coke for my for my caffeine needs not 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 wanting to risk anything not that there should be much issues but you know um, after after Wixie's story, I'm just I'm just a bit a tad a tad bit careful, which I don't think is a bad thing. <laughs> what are you guys eating for Christmas? Uh, so we have two two kind of Christmas meals. We have the f one for Christmas Eve, which is just like a very simple, you know, just some bread, um, potato salad, you know, stuff like that. Did he you can't drink coffee? Um, no, so I don't like coffee itself. <laughs> uh, energy drinks is what gives me a headache. Or a, like a bit of a headache. So. But yeah, coffee, I just don't like the taste of it. Same with like beer. I don't, I don't like the taste of alcohol. Yeah. And then like the big Christmas, Christmas uh, food. What do you call it? It's not dinner. But yeah, um, that is where we put out all the... That's where we do all the good stuff. Lunch. Thank you. <laughs> what time was it? And the end the odd person. I think I went to it maybe 10 times this year, really. I, yeah. Unless someone's streaming, I'm not necessarily on actively on Twitch. Um, I just check every now and then if someone's going live, but other than that, it's like might run in the background, but that's about it. I just thought the game crashed, but I just think it needs the jingle to fully play out until it allows to load the next room, which is weird. Uh, 
what's the missile button? This is also one nice thing. You no longer need to like cycle through to fire missiles. So you just get a nice button. Part of me wonders if you can get this with like a very well timed wall jump. Big, big family lunch on the 25th. And then this year on the 26th, we're like going out to a restaurant with like extended family. And I don't really want to, I'm gonna be honest. Not because I don't like the family, um, but because I don't like eating at restaurants <laughs> on busy holidays. <laughs> because that just sounds like a bad time. And it's expensive. But, oh well. Despite the main reason which of course is just <laughs> Watching is very passive. And streaming is definitely more active. Streaming is definitely a lot more active than just watching. Like, I can't do taxes while I'm actively streaming, but I can do them while watching streams. <laughs> Which I did, and I really hope I didn't do anything wrong. <laughs> but it should, it should, it should be fine. Oh, this section is horrible. Get me out of here. Sleep, and I don't like that. Ah, there we go. But yeah, by the way, the 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 new lighting that you might be able to do, um, see, especially if you compare to old streams, um, that is also because of the uh, key lights it's a suggestion of your T check. I'm like very lucky that when you mention key lights, I was like looking online for some. And on that day, specifically, they had like a sell for 30% off. I was like, yep, I'm, I'm taking it. Screw it. <laughs> we're, we're investing now. <sighs> Though my setup for it is still a bit... I mean, it's a very me setup. Uh, which I might, I, might, I, might, I might share how it looks on you. Discord later. <laughs> yep. Woo! Oh, there's nothing. Can I have a better look at the lighting when this video goes on YouTube? Fair. <laughs> You're making the money. <laughs> Gun off the production value. I mean. I haven't spent like everything from the last Twitch payout, so this is essentially where that money went, which is exactly how I want these things to go. And everything I make from streaming, I want to reinvest into streaming. It's gonna be very interesting to see, like, once I um, make the move to move to. Not to my own place, but uh, move out into the city where I work at. Which is still the plan for next year, end of next year. It's gonna be very interesting to see if I... How streaming will continue. <laughs> I mean, the internet connection should be better in a city. I'd hope. You never know with... With German telecommunication services. Yeah. Oh my. Well, I'm out of results. Please die. Thank you. No, 
concrete plans now. I mean, I know to what city I want to move, and I know that I want to move to um, an apartment with, I don't know how you would call it in English, but like, multiple people. Good old Viggy. Um, because uh, being alone kind of sounds horrible. Uh, even if I have a rest day amongst busy period, I just don't have the, a bandwidth and pleasure to socialize. For someone who's an accident, I'm just hanging out with people, but it's possible to... I can totally feel that, Becky. Um, despite me not being an extrovert, but rather an introvert. At a certain point, there, there is something as too much socializing. <laughs> Especially if you want to take care of the people you try to interact with. That's always like my worry. It's like, oh, I'd love to, love to meet even more people, but I know I couldn't. Um, Take care of all the people then. Uh, yeah. Wait, where can we go? Moving in with roommates? Yeah. Because I don't, I don't, I don't like the idea of uh, having an apartment all for myself. That is. Doesn't sound fun. <laughs> Being on a server, we're gonna see nobody over the coming days. I already kind of ranked. Aww. So look out for the food I'm going to post. Your food always looks amazing, TJ. Oh, the lag. Oh. Like honestly, I think I, th I think I think there is a hidden. Uh, there is a. There definitely is a... What do you call I can't English today, I'm sorry. <laughs> you would make a good cook. There we go. <laughs> Glad to get that some other stoned... I was just curious, I assume. If all my country respond. I'm... I don't like it when people are like, Oh, why, why don't you respond despite them seeing you being online? It's like... Just because I'm online doesn't mean... No. <laughs> I have different things to do in life. <laughs> Sometimes. Sometimes I don't just have the, the right answer. Right then and there. Which is perfectly normal. Ah. So this is the game telling you that you need to defeat four bosses to move on. I'd want to respond properly with the whole effort. That makes perfect sense, Becky. Making a whole chicken, I'm very much looking forward to, to what I'm learning from that experience. I need to start. I really should start uh, practicing cooking skills. <laughs> I wish I wasn't as lazy as I am. Because <laughs> cooking seems to be such a nice skill to have. I mean, I can do very basic stuff. Ah, okay. Uh, oh, no, I didn't want to go all the way down. Thank you for that game. Appreciate it. Boop. No, I. Well, the game tells me I can't leave, so here we are. This is not where I wanted to go, but that's where we are going. Um. Find the word. Yeah, exactly. I'm, I'm not good with words today. Uh, you have to excuse me for that. Uh, social media is great for connectivity, but if I like because it's so accessible, some point I should respond. Best patient. 
Nah. I mean, the only time I'm... Uh, I get, like, impatient with people not responding is when it's, like, something very important. <laughs> but I think that that falls under a completely different category. Um, I think everything is me. Like, there's something wrong with you. Like, fragility thing. Hey, Craig! Well, come in. God damn it, Reef. I, I like that, uh, Becky. Just saying that currently is nothing like you, you don't have a response right now. Or telling people you're busy. That's kind of what I like to do. Or when I feel it's like the end of a conversation, I kind of like to just give a little reaction emote. Because I think that very well signals like, oh yeah, I've read it. Uh, I thought about it. This, this is the response you're gonna get. But at the end of the day, no one's entitled to. Um. There is a run button in this game. I just can't find it. Hold on. Hey, Reef. Um, I'm still, still in post-cold mode, but otherwise I'm fine. I hope you have been doing well. I'm guessing you have been uh, Minecrafting quite a bit. <laughs> Would be my guess. <laughs> Gotta get those points. Yeah. Okay, what looks optional? Left looks optional, so we're doing optional. In true Metroid fashion. Great, it's a refill station. That's what I needed. <laughs> uh, wait, how do I do this again? No. Okay, like that. There we go. <laughs> no, you. <laughs> I feel like you used the sentence know you quite a bit. Have you ever thought of making it uh, an emote on your channel? <laughs> I honestly think that would fit quite perfectly. <laughs> oh, dear. Ugh. Gameplay! No, I have not thank you, I will now. <laughs> You're welcome for the idea. <laughs> oh, I remember this room and I don't remember if I like it or not. I do have an everything is fine emote now. <gasps> Love it. <laughs> Gonna bake a cake. What kind of cake are you baking, teacher? Oh, God, falling through places. That makes me very curious, TJ. Oh, dear. You can make this jump. Let's go! The skills! One hundred percent pure gaming skill. Let's go. <laughs> Ow. A very basic apple cake. Oh, I love apple cake. Everything, everything with apples in it, it to me is like, I love it automatically. Charge beam. Charge beam. 
What's about moving out? Um, my plan is to move out. Um, by like the end of next year, presumably. Um, but not move into like my own apartment, but one that I would share with other people. Because uh, living alone kind of doesn't sound fun. <laughs> Never liked cooked fruit. Oh, cooked food is so good. Aside from pineapple, because my stomach hates uh, warm pineapple. But no, cooked or baked apple is like, oh, it's so good. You could have never stayed your stem. <laughs> apple crumble and cream. Mm. And it's expensive. Oh yeah, having your own apartment is expensive as hell. Not not, not doing that. Also, because I won't earn super much next year, still. Um, it's once I'm done with my apprenticeship, then I probably have a lot more funds. But I'd like to already have like an apartment before that, or have my own, or not my own place, but a place I share with people before then. Um, especially because while I still have vocational school, it probably makes moving a lot easier. Because I don't need to take time off, I just have like half a week where I, or like have a week where I only have half days, so. Having time and stuff. Pineapple is an underrated hot fruit. My stomach hates it, so uh, I'd have to disagree. <laughs> Ow. Well, the problem with that would be that uh, I don't think either one of us would want to <laughs> change countries. <laughs> Ow. Welcome to the worst boss in the entire game, by the way. It is Spore Spawn. It is by far the most boring boss this game has to offer. No one likes Spore Spawn. Exhilarating gameplay. <laughs> I have no points. <laughs> well, you gotta earn them slowly, Becky. Hey, Lise. Good morning to you, too. How are you doing? I hope you two have a good pre-Christmas time. Oh my god, it finally starts to move slower. What, no more gamble? Yeah, you can gamble, you just need enough points to gamble. Oh my God damn it this there isn't even a challenge to this it just wobbles around oh my days he's still not dead gamble off risky move but sure why not? Oh my, thank goodness. Hey, Spore Spawn's dead. Hey, trash boss. Get me out of here.
Oh wait, what did I miss? I'm ill. Oh no, <laughs> not you as well, Lise. <laughs> well, I hope you're getting better soon. I've just recovered from a... From an annoying cold. Every- it's just, just everyone's sick. It's incredible. Got a chest infection, general cold. Aw, oh, chest infection is nasty. Well, I hope you recover very soon. Putting a barrier. <laughs> yeah, be careful. No one, no one infect each other through through Twitch chat. Thank you. That'd be. Oh, you can make this job. Maybe I shouldn't try. How about that? Ow. Pure skill. <laughs> Stepped out abroad, home the plague, and it turned into a chest infection. Oh no. <laughs> Ki yeah, kids these days. It's. it's spreading the virus again. I'm still like the, the fact that that it wasn't it wasn't school that got me sick is still like. Uh, It's not what I would have expected, I'm not gonna lie. Come on. Maybe I should use the charge beam. That could be helpful. I had a child cough on me in the tram sometime in December. Ah, oh, that's just... That's just rude. Coughing on people? No, that's a that that that's a big no go. I will just continue to walk around in with a face mask uh, in enclosed spaces. Thank you very much. <laughs> not, not dealing with that shit. My sixth September, summer from studies. But my final year late January now. Oh. I'm sure you'll also smash that, Becky. <laughs> Knowing you. Also, I'm generally the only one wearing a mask in public transit. Oh yeah, it's the same for me. There's like people coughing and sneezing around all over the place. And I'm like, nope. Uh, I'm, I'm not having it. Absolutely not. Ow. Maybe you shouldn't step into spikes. Oh dear. Oh. This seems to be a very fun room to be in. Hello. Something? Maybe? No? Lame. I wonder if you're. I really wish people would would have learned from the three-year-long pandemic that if you're sick, you should wear a face mask or stay at home. But no, people just don't. <laughs> okay. So if I remember correctly, yeah. So normally you're supposed to get the high jump to get up here, but I think if you're like good enough. Never mind about being good enough, you could just make this jump. 
This might have something to do with the new physics. But I remember... I want to go down here first because... In Europe, people start to act like they're secretly bitten by zombies when they start to feel sick. They kind of do. Yeah. Like, the amount of times you hear, oh, no, it's just fine. It's like, oh, dear. Nope. Mm-mm. Well, that's a shame. Can I get out of here? Can I get, okay, can I, good. Hmm. This one? Safe station. Sweet. She has a lot to be proud of. country is so frowned upon to take sick days I feel like that's the thing in a lot of places like even I sometimes feel bad when I like oh now I need to take the, the day off again because I'm sick I think like at this point it's just so in, 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 in ingrained that it's like something that doesn't look favorably upon but it's horrible like if I'm sick I don't want to go to work and like infect other people even if I theoretically feel well enough to work. This doesn't make sense. I mean, it's something different when I can work from home. I mean, I've done that. I've done, I've, I did work from home when I was sick. Because it was like, ah, now I feel well enough to work. It's not pleasant, but... Um... No need to call in sick for that. Yep. Ow. I like COVID in the respect. That was the magic word of I'm contagious, so I can't be here. <laughs> it's a very good excuse. I really enjoyed telling him off over the years. <laughs> oh, company bosses are something else. Many reassure people that they deserve one. That is very important. Like people should not feel like um like their problems aren't aren't valid. It goes for mental stuff just as well as for physical stuff. The amount of time people are like, oh, you know, don't be like that. It's not that bad. I hate that. <laughs> I, I hate that sentence so much. Uh, buttons, please. There we go. Hi, John. Oh, I could theoretically get the... Tang. I just realized it really helps that I know this game because otherwise I would be stuck in some of these places for quality hours. <laughs> Could you not murder me? Thank you. I please, please. That's the work days. I got a tummy ache and my GP rough have sick days. That's how it should be. Bedroom? Bedroom. Who doesn't hate their idiot boss? That's what people bond over. 
I mean, yeah, kind of. <laughs> I have yet to meet a person who's like fully enthusiastically likes their boss. I mean, I don't mind my boss too much, gonna be honest. How are you supposed to dodge the stuff? <laughs> Jeez. Oh my days. It's all up. And off the banners. Doesn't feel like much. Twenty twenty four would be fun. I don't know if I want to have the new year, I'm gonna be completely honest. Ow. Okay, let's see if I can actually first try this boss. If I manage to not die before that, that'd be great. Everyone. I have never watched any of those movies, Becky. <laughs> and my co-worker always looks very shocked at me when, when he realizes that there are so many, like, classic movies I've never seen. I mean, up until, I think, three years ago, three and a half years ago, I hadn't seen any of the Harry Potter movies, Becky, so... <laughs> People like us exist? <laughs> Turns out. <laughs> oh, crap. Oh. This boss is chaotic, I don't like it. And stream all the things we over in Discord. <laughs> I mean, I don't have any any anything uh, planned for for New Year's yet, so. When well, the right mind watches the Hobbit. <laughs> I see the the opinions regarding these movies uh, seem to be very strong. I have a Hobbit extended and 4K. Still not dropping that into the marathon. A small people gotta stick together. That is true, Becky. <laughs> Small people, small people really have to stick together. How much health do you have? Ah, dang it. Oh, oh, no, I need to kill them. Get me out. So that was the first big boss of the game. Always a bit anticlimactic. I think there's truly only one game where Crate. <coughs> <coughs> got the presence he deserved. As 
that a zero mission? Okay, where is my secret? Where is my item game? I can see there is one in this room. Oh, there it is. I'm the opposite. Make a detour. Nah, we will manage. This, this is not the information I thought I'd, I'd I, I would gain today. I'm gonna be completely honest, but uh, sure. Why? Why not? I mean, I can get up there if I bomb jump. That's not an issue. The question is, how much do sense does it make to sequence break a game I don't really know that much about? each other after all. I mean that, yep. I, I, I can see that being a thing. Huh. Okay. I mean, not okay, but... So when I said it's a good thing I know this game, um, what I meant is I know this game up until this point, specifically. <laughs> Everything now <laughs> is just... Speed boost. All of them speed boost blocks? All of them speed boost blocks, okay. I mean, I can sequence break, maybe. That's a chocolate with a cherry and alcohol inside. Oh, I hate those. They taste horrible. <laughs> it's a crime against chocolate, in my opinion. <laughs> uh, why didn't I move on over there? All oh, right, I remember. Maybe you can... Might be a way to get up there, which is what I'm thinking. I guess that would clearly allow me to uh, clear that section. Or we're doing the weird thing. Leap actually. Now the one time you're trying to bomb jump, of course you can't get it to work. That's great.
God, I wish bomb jumping had a consistent timing to it. I would not. I mean, I'm pretty sure this is not what I'm supposed to do. I can't get the timing, goddammit. Hmm. Last time I looked in the tunnels. Scream is there, that's bomb. that put you off getting back his game. <laughs> I don't think I'm just a dead. McDonald's ice cream. McDonald's ice cream is amazing. Honestly. Very expensive, but super underrated. So good. I'm 100% sure I need to do something down in warfare, but I can't. Oh, we can't even go... I mean, we can go back. Uh, still an item up to the right. Which I don't think necessarily does anything for me. Um, Tom Steiner. <laughs> They're good, Deep Jack. They're very good. I think they have a high jump. Hmm. Oh, I was about to say, oh, I can't go back up, or the game doesn't want me to go back up. Oh, Screw that. I mean, if I was good enough at the game, I could go back up. Samus, make a wall jump, would ya? <laughs> Please. Oh, the wall jump in this game sucks. Oh, good. Nah. Okay, we're locked down here. Which I like, because it means the game knows where it wants me to be. Which means there's probably just some bombable wall I have missed. Uh, chocolate little dice with marzipan and stuff. I think this is like the only form I like marzipan in. I hate that stuff otherwise. <laughs> Pie is a sweet person. Oh. I mean, that doesn't sound too bad. Again, I like stuff with fruit in it, so that might be. Might be the reason why I don't think it sounds too bad. Okay, where is the bombable wall? There's gotta be some place where I can go through. I mean, I know that you can. I think there's like a specific jump you can do in order to get that from the other side. But again, that's like all, all, all speed running knowledge I kind of have in the back of my head from watching. But I have no idea how to execute like 90% of the stuff. <laughs> It has to be this room. Hmm. Wait, picks and blankets is my answer, actually. Huh. I like Marzipan, my sister. For Christmas when I was younger. I don't like Marzipan. Nope. <laughs> I'm, I'm very simple. I like chocolate. And that's about all I need.
good chocolate. That 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 is all that is required to make me happy. Wait, I'm gonna gonna need to check something. Pictures is not helpful. Oh, my days. <laughs> I love when you get like bombarded with ads, that's fun. So yeah, it is it is the one up there that I thought. Well, the question is just how do we get through it? I see people are winning their gambles. How do you get through this room? My goodness, this is horrible. I hate this. <laughs> this is the one thing I don't like about old Metroid games, is they can be really Flipping annoying when it comes to stuff like that. Okay, the internet doesn't help me, which is f fucking fantastic. Let's bomb every inch off this floor. I'll go through here. Fantastic. Can't be awful. Well, there is a cooldown on the gamble. Uh. Also, did you crush my bot? Because normally it should tell you there's a cooldown on it. Okay, you didn't. It, you did not crush the bot, which is good. I never got to gamble. Oh no. Well, it should tell you that there is a minimum amount required normally. If you try roulette as a command, does that work? How the fuck do I get through this room? Oh my god, I hate this so much. <laughs> huh. Weird. Oh boy. Okay. Let's get the actual window for this. Uh. Uh. Uh, 
let's see it like that. Shouldn't be that difficult, could it? Oh my days, come on. Mm hmm. Flash has been playing almost Christmas. Oh, I'm permanently stuck in my head. Oh no. Oh. That. Playing songs on repeat permanently is 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 not is not fun. Okay. Oh my god, I'm so stupid. I know the solution to our problem, and it's dumb. And it makes me feel dumb. <laughs> oh no. Oh no. Why? Um, so what you can do is go down here. Which in hindsight makes sense. Oh boy. Okay, cool. Well, a good thing the internet exists, or I might have stuck around here for forever. I like that song at first, and now I hate it. That's always the case if you have to listen to a song like on repeat constantly. I once made the the, the grave mistake of turning a song I liked into my alarm clock in the morning. I can no longer hear that song. I hate it with a passion. It's like one of those things you absolutely should just never do. Probably down there underneath the lava. I don't know how much damage I take in the lava, so I just like won't. Too risky, not doing it. Oh. I think the lava. Yep, lava's rising. Huh. <laughs> yeah, I mean, you learn from your own mistakes, so. In that sense, I'm kind of glad I did it, so I know I'll never do it again. Um, but yeah, arms in general make me feel angry. I guess that's kind of the point, right? They're supposed to make you wake up, and no one likes that. This looks like a feasible jump. Uh, wall jumping in this game is so freaky. The timing on it is super odd, but it kind of works. And it's technically something the game teaches you at some point. There we go. Just don't need a thruple beam for that. Is that kind of one of the two? They're like essentially two hidden moves are in this game that you get taught. Uh at some points by NPCs. And so... Knowing that from the get-go can be really nice. Wait a second. 
I already like sequence breaking, might as well do it properly. That. No, I didn't mean to. You know what, sure. Whatever. I don't know. I'm calling an electrician because our electric box kept breaking. Turns out it was the smoke alarm running out of battery. Oh. That, that's not good. Oh, it ate my. No! Oh! This enemy is placed maliciously well. Because it's really hard to jump out of a wall jump into another. Um, into another spin jump. Oh, okay, you can. There we go. We're sequence breaking, screw it. We're no longer sequence break. Huh? Huh. We are continuing to sequence break. <laughs> we are no longer sequence breaking. I need the... I need the speed boost for this, and I don't have it yet. Spin jump, wall jump, alright, Mario. Well, Samus has many skills, you know. I mean, she is a space bounty hunter. Makes sense, you know. I mean, can Mario shoot plasma beams from his hand? I don't think he can. Uh, what is the point of this? No one knows. Metro or Mario older? Uh, Mario's older. Yeah. Mario's older by quite a bit. Ah, these things. I think there's a beam upgrade, I think. That's just embarrassing. Uh, I need some advice. How oh, smart to be a start disconnect from my Wi Fi? Apparently, the software problem is Samsung. Huh. I have never worked with a smart TV in my life. I have no idea. <laughs> Sadly. So, I. Yeah, okay, sure. Just make me clip through it. Platforms are a suggestion now, love it. Oh, come on! This jump isn't even that hard, I'm just terrible. Ow, you do way too much damage. Can't go over there, which is fine. Uh, linear cable is an option. Huh. Yeah, connecting it via uh, via Ethernet should definitely help.
Because if that doesn't work, that is definitively the TV being broken. Apologies. Oh! This seems possible. I'm too scared. Note, missiles just murder everything in this game. It's fine by me. Okay. Enough, enough changing the sequence, let's, let's go with intended route. This connection's so perfect. That does not sound good. Uh, there is an item, but I think it's like over there. Oh yeah, there it is, actually. Sometimes bomb jumps just work, and sometimes they don't. And I'm just gonna blame me not being consistent enough at them. I like technology randomly makes these decisions. I mean, technology does just randomly make decisions. Sometimes that's how that works. That's where the first thing you learn in IT studies is usually, if something's broken, uh, try turning it off and on again. Go through here yet. <laughs> Never seen a more obvious refill room. I hear lava rising, and I don't like that. Oh. Aww. Ah. I think that's actually the entrance to, to Ridley. Which is, I think, the... An ultimate boss we want to fight. Alright. Through the horror room we go. Run, run. That just loops around. That does nothing for me. Jump. Let's jump. Nice. I mean, these little things are cute. I like them. Adorable. Inspired by the Alien franchise, they were very much inspired by the Alien franchise leaks. That is, that is true. I think like all sci-fi stuff kind of 
in the end, like, everything kind of expires itself again. Like, you take a bit of from that franchise, take a bit of that franchise. And at the end, you get something cool, hopefully. Ow. Okay, so we've been running around in, uh, in a circle, which is great. <laughs> Have you seen those films? I mean, you're asking me if I've seen the movie, please. Um, no, I haven't. <laughs> I'm also not super good with horror. So there's that as well. Hey. That was a free missile upgrade. Which doesn't necessarily help me. Aside from me managing to get all the way up. Wait, no. Why haven't I been in the door down there? This is great, not knowing a game and goldfish memory. Both hitting at the same time. Mm. I love the horror, means you're not a psychopath. I don't think people who like horror are necessarily psychopaths. <laughs> I can see, I can, I can see why people would like it. I mean, there is something weirdly, weirdly f uh, fun about playing, like for example, Phasmo. Oh uh, yeah, right. That's th that was the issue. I'm getting the ice beam. I mean, at this point, oh, oh, come on. Oh, I made a mistake. Oh, no. Come on. Why is bomb jumping here so hard? The other one perfectly. There we go. Get me out of here. Ah! Oh, fuck you. I'm gonna stream Dead Space New Year with headphone users. Oh, I'm looking forward to that. <laughs> that sounds like a fun experience. Oh, come on. Ah, uh, okay, I see. So you're supposed to come out of the door below, and then you're actually able to access this bit up here. The f Get me there. Great, there is a massive Windows notification in my way now. Still need to VR Resi 8. Got horror- I mean, horror games I understand. Horror games in VR? Just doesn't seem fun. <laughs> oh, turns out I was. Oh, you absolutely can run through here. Great. Hey, it's the speed boost. <laughs> I love spending half an hour running around in circles. Kind of embarrassing. 
been watching on mobile later the whole time. No teaching, I'm sorry. <laughs> I tried. I mean, you don't come here to see like great gaming skills, right? Hit it with a hammer. Hit it with a hammer is always a valuable, uh, a va valid, I can't talk today. Always a valid uh, fix for technology if the first two options don't work. But only then. Wait, do I go the right way? I'm not going the right way. Which is fine. Uh, I need to go to this big boost thing here. I'm here for the great stream and chat. Aw, thank you. Wait, you've been playing Assassin's Creed on VR. Does it enhance the experience? I've like no idea. I have never tried VR in my life, to be completely honest. I don't really see the appeal too much. So I'm always wondering if it like enhances the experience actually. Now we have the speed boost, which is nice. Um, ah, that should open up that thing we couldn't go through previously. Yes, there we go. Much better. Okay, and this is where we need the ice beam, I think. If I'm not completely mistaken. Yep. Well, this is awkward. There we go. That's where we get the ice beam. It is where we get the ice peak. There is a beam upgrade I missed. This looks wrong. This doesn't look quite right. <laughs> oh, you can actually turn off stuff in this game, I forgot. Which is really weird. I guess it's a nice feature, I guess. Everyone on Steam having recently come huh. To get Beat Saber on the quest, but I already have it for PS5 VR. Wait, you have multiple VR headsets, teacher? Huh. This room is gonna murder me. Mm -hmm. Oh, this is going great. Oh, that's how you get up here. Great, that makes sense.
Okay, now I think we can go back up again. Now that we have the ice beam, that allows us to do a lot of platform building. Reversible game. Reversible three D structures. Interesting. Yeah, I don't know. I'm like completely. When it comes to VR stuff, I have like absolutely zero clue. Like no idea what's currently out. System wise, etc. Like, ah. Yeah, there is a beam we can still get. Oh boy, here comes the fun part. Aww. This part of the game... Like nearly all Metroid games have stuff like this where you build like a, not a bridge, like a staircase upwards. And it is always terrible. <laughs> hey. Oh, but now we can go all the way up actually. Hold on. I mean, it's a bit more finicky, but... Ow. Oh. Come on. Samus! Samus, please! Oh god. Okay, I'm I'm losing I'm losing focus. Which means that it's definitely time for me to get some food. Stop it. There we go. Uh in regards to VR, I know that I have a dissertation about VR stuff. I mean it's you Ooh. That's cool. How long am I gonna play for? Until I find the next save room, to be precise. Shh. Hello? I'm stuck. I'm actually- I'm dead. Okay, uh, that was fun. <laughs> Surprisingly enough, the hardest thing in this game is to make small jumps. <laughs> oh my god, there's a safe room, thank goodness. Thank goodness. Oh, my goodness. <laughs> I forgot about climbing games. Climbing VR games, that sounds like something. I mean, that's, that sounds like something you could very well do with VR. Like climbing, puzzle stuff. I don't know about action. Action still seems weird. Like, I feel the risk of running into a wall would be a bit too high. All right. Well, aside from running around a few times in a circle, I'd say that was kind of successful, considering this is my second time ever playing this. 
But hopefully we won't be stuck as much next time around. That'd be epic. That'd be lovely.